guys, and welcome to another suspenseful episode of Lifeless Planet. Right, we're just continuing on. The story is building, guys. We actually, on the previous episode, just found out that this guy, um, actually, um, the guy that was sitting at the chair, actually uh, locked himself into this place um, and pretty much... It like pretty much like starved to death inside of this place because um, he was hiding from something. Something was after him. He wanted to keep something out, and we will find out what that something possibly is this episode. We have to wait and see, guys. I love you guys so much. Thanks for sticking with me. Let's see what's going on. Just uh, checking my surroundings or whatnot, uh, trying to find where to go next. Like I, uh, you know, announced previously in the previous episodes. Uh, I can make use of this. Oh, here we go. All right, so we found something. We found some uh, dynamite. So something somewhere needs to blow up. If I can just find where to place this. Let's see. God, it's dark. Do y'all see this, guys? It's ridiculous. I can, like, barely see where I'm going. Oh, also, I'll leave in the description below. Um, I think it was sometime in June, actually. I went to, actually, a tournament at a arcade that's actually around my area. Um, it's maybe about, I think about like 30 minutes from my house. But anyway, uh, they were hosting a Street Fighter tournament. Um, and I actually recorded some of the highlights and leisure uh, matches, epic leisure matches. So I'll leave the description, you know, down below. Uh, so just, uh, you know, check it out. Um, you know, go ahead and hit that like button, show me some love. Really appreciate it, guys. Thanks for sticking with me. Let's do this. the heck is this thing? Oh, man. I hope I don't run out of oxygen while I'm down here. Jesus. I don't see any oxygen anywhere. Walking around with some dynamite in my hand. Oh, God. Alright, let's backtrack. This might be one of those moments in the game where you have to go all the way back. <laughs> well, whoever cares. Because I don't care. Because whether we go back, forward, left, right, up, down, it's going down live. That's all I got to say. <laughs> all right. Let's see. All right. Let's see here. All right. This is actually where um, after I went inside the facility, I fell down. Alright, let's see, um, yeah, I can't really get out of here, it doesn't look like I can really blow anything up, so I'm just going to pick this back up, um, I don't think it's over here, guys, sadly, I was hoping, like, uh, maybe I could, like, blow it up, but to be honest, now that I've actually went back and I've thought about it, it really wouldn't make much sense for me to actually go back that way that I came, considering that we've already explored pretty much everything before I went into this bunker, so... It's probably got to be maybe somewhere around inside of that um, closed-off room. I apologize, guys, for wasting, like, about a good 30 seconds of your life. I will promise to make it up to you in the near future. I promise. Alright, let's see here. Do, 
Where the heck do I put it? This is getting to be ridiculous. What is this? Oh no! Oh! oh. I I ho! Oh. We found it! We found it, guys! I think we found it. It's beeping. I'm getting away from this thing. I don't know how big this last radius is. Okay, please don't come. Please nothing. Don't come out. Don't come out. Nothing. Come out. Nothing. Come out. What is in here? What is in here? So the Russians found some kind of portal that transported them to this planet. And then, and then things went terribly wrong. Oh man. So like, it's like a teleportation device or something like, um, those are some schematics on, uh, some type of teleportation device. Go up here. What is that blinking? Oh man, dead space. Got the crazy cross ritual, red glowing, scary thing, Majig. There. All right. Virus распространяется все быстрее. Все попытки сдержать его пока не увенчались успехом. Однако мы не сдаемся. Мои коллеги работают без устали. Здесь мы имеем дело с неземными существами. Поэтому многого мы не знаем. Задача очень сложная, но мы ее разрешим. Мы должны ее разрешить. The virus is spreading faster now. All our efforts to contain it have so far been futile. We haven't given up hope. However, and my colleagues are working tirelessly, we are not dealing with terrestrial species, and thus there is so much we don't know. The challenge is great, and yet we will prevail. We must prevail. Right, so where do I go now? Let's see. What is up with all these beds? Okay. So did my wife die? С каждым новым опытом ее пробы кажутся все более перспективными. Позже я занесу в журнал больше подробностей. Сейчас просто нет на это времени. Amazing. With each test that we run, her samples appear more promising. I will log more details later. There simply isn't time right now. All right. Oh man, what is this? What is this? And they got the weird music playing. Great. I think my mind is playing tricks on me. A vision of home. My mind is playing tricks on me. Thought for a moment I was back on Earth after the hallucination passed. I found a human trackway loading out of the underground facility. The footprints glow green for reasons I can't explain. I took some samples but haven't had time to analyze. The footprints seem to lead out of the facility, so for now I'm going to follow them, but with caution. All right. Oh man, it's pushing me back. Push us in here. And we're just gonna stand right here because I don't know if it's gonna blow up or not. That was a little explosion, not not much. Alright, we're not gonna touch that because I don't want to get like chopped up. What are we doing here? 
What is that? I can barely see that. It's like a light up there somehow. God, it's freaking dark. Oh man. <laughs> I found like the one ramp and probably in the entire room. Alright, let's see. Need to find a way to turn this on. Okay, so can I jump up there? I can't. Okay, what was that noise? What is that? What is that? Alright, we're gonna hurry up and get off there. We're gonna hurry up and get off this ground. I don't like that sound. It sounded like something was like coming up behind me. That is so freaky. Seeing those like green uh footprints or whatnot. Looks like something's following me or something. Okay, now where is the switch at? Where the heck is it? Let's see. So I can barely see with this little tiny flashlight. Let me see. Let me see if I can find it, guys. Just give me a moment. I apologize. Oh, there it is. It's on the side of the uh, conveyor belt thing. All right, here we go. Oh, God. It's going to be over here. Really interesting uh, soundtrack. I've always loved like orchestral type themed music. Got like a pipe or something here. Yeah, I'm not sure if y'all have actually seen my uh, clothespin challenge video, but uh, <laughs> yeah, my face is actually still healing from the uh, clothespins. I literally like, it pinched me so hard in some places that I was like bleeding. It was crazy. Couldn't believe it. I was like, man, this is crazy. But um, I mean, like I said, you know, as long as it doesn't hurt anybody, as long as it doesn't, uh, uh, offend anyone, you know, whatnot. Of course, you know, we can't please everyone, but, you know, if y'all give me a request, I'll do it. I love you guys. I'm here for your entertainment and mine. Just checking out, like, just the detail in, like, this game. Like, I mean, it's so simply made, but at the same time, they, you know, really have, like, nice textures and stuff on like the rocks and if you look at like the pipes and things like that you know especially to be like a little indie game I think this game was only maybe like $15 on the Xbox Marketplace uh, store you know it's, it's well worth it I'm really enjoying this game I hope you guys are too so yeah I just can't wait to just see like what happens next like what is this like all this green stuff like they were trying to mine this stuff I've located an abandoned mining operation. The rocks here appear to share the same phosphorescent properties of the human footprints I'm following. I suspect that there's some radiation involved here. Not sure if this area is safe, so I'm moving on. Following the green footprints as best as I can. See here. Okay, we're on some type of like cliff now. Right, let's see here. Oh god. Oh god. No, 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 oh <sighs> well, <laughs> achievement unlocked. Death by gravity. <laughs> wow. I mean, it didn't even seem like I fell really that far. Like, why'd I die? But anyway. 
Alright, well, let's just go back up there again. So obviously, that was probably where we need to go, guys. That's actually our first death in the series. Wasn't nothing to write home about, but hey. Let's actually, uh... Not this cow. Oh! No! 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 The, uh... Not this cow. Oh! No! 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 Oh! Oh, God. God, I almost fell. Did you see that, guys? God, it tried to kill me, yo. Again. What is this? What is this? Okay. That's... Oh. And we are... Whoa! Yeah! Oh, man. They got a city here. Okay, let's just uh, easily... Jump across these rocks. Yeah, dog, that's a long way out. You'll have time to pray and everything before you hit the ground. Uh, let's see. Going on up. On up. Okay, a little bit more platforming, guys. It's like a little, kind of like a, like a city or something. Like, big old skyscraper over there. God, so like, obviously something... You know, civilization was living here, like, previously in the past. So cool. Getting closer. Oh, man, someone is standing there. Oh, God. Okay, guys. Uh, we're actually out of time. I love you guys so much. All right, three, two, one. It's going down the line. Woo!